This is a parasite that's never been documented to cause infections in humans before. I know everyone's sort of looking at this as sort of the, the sexy yuck factor of, of, of the story, this big live worm, but the fact that it's the first human infection with this particular parasite, I think is really important because it, it just shows us that there may have been a hundred years between pandemics, but we are still seeing new infections pop up every year. There have been 30 new infections in the last 30 years, Kieran, and most of them are infections that go from the animal world to the human world. And it just reflects that encroachment of a burgeoning human population on animal habitats. We're interacting more with wild animals. Domestic animals are interacting more with wild animals. We're interacting more with flora. We're going foraging. We're eating things we forage. We're putting them up in our houses. So there are more opportunities for new infections to occur.